everyone! Today we are going to make our jump rope. But before starting, there are some things that I want to explain to you. Have you heard about gravity force? Gravity force affects the objects toward their center. Earth's gravity force keeps us on the Earth's surface. While we are standing, we don't apply any force against the gravity force. But while we are jumping, we apply a force which is equal to our weight against the gravity force. Actually, while we are playing with our jump rope, we apply series of forces against the gravity. Because of that, we get tired. Now, if you are ready, we can start designing our jump rope. Before starting, there are two rules that I have to apply. First of all, I have to tidy my hair up. After that, I have to put my goggles on. Now, I'm ready to start. As you see, all the materials that we need for this model are available in our kit. These are wooden cylinders, guide pieces, 3D printed parts for handles and our rope. Before starting, I want to show the difference between two sides of cylinder. As you see, one of the sides has a circle and the other one has square on it. While putting the cylinder onto the lathe, the side which has square on will fit on that point and the other side will fit on that point. After placing the cylinder, you can lock it by turning lathe's arm on clockwise. To unlock the cylinder, you should turn lathe's arm on counterclockwise. When you unlock the cylinder, you can take it out easily. As you see, there is an arrow on the shaper pen. This arrow should always point up. Shaper pen should be perpendicular to the metal part. While shaping our cylinders, movements should be short. We will touch and pull back. We will touch and pull back. We will shape our cylinders with these short movements. While designing our cylinders, we will use our guides to shape our cylinders. But before starting, we should draw reference lines for ourselves and we can understand how to shape our cylinders. Now, we are ready to start. our shaping process for first cylinder. Now it's time to clean particles of the surface. To clean the surface we will use sandpaper. We finished cleaning process for our first cylinder. Now we can check it with our guides. As you see, it fits perfectly. Now we can continue with second cylinder. We are placing our second cylinder. And we will repeat all the processes for second one, like drawing reference lines. If we draw lines, we can start shaping now. Now we will check it with our guides. As you see, it looks nice. Now it's time to clean our lathe. To clean our lathe, we will use vacuum cleaner. Our handles are ready, now it's time to put our pieces 
together. First of all, we will stick handles and 3D parts together. To stick them, we will use a little bit hot glue. First one is ready. Now we will repeat same process for second one. Our handles are ready now. It's time to stick rope. We will put hot glue here. Finally, our jump rope is ready. Today we made a jump rope together. Now I'm going to garden to jump with my rope. See you soon!